guys, welcome back to Trending on Eniola Badmos TV. In my opinion, sex is very, very important in relationship. Why I'm saying that because um, it if you're in love with someone, you can't just love someone by his face or whatever. You need sex in a relationship. So sex is important in my opinion, but I don't know what others think. But for me, it's important for me. But if I fall in love with someone, I know what I want from that person. And sex is part of it. Okay, is sex actually important in a relationship? I think it depends on the individuals. Honestly, in my opinion, I believe it's better to have a relationship without sex. But that's just me. I think sex kind of messes up your head. I feel like a lot of people get into a relationship because of sex. So sometimes you can be with someone and maybe the sex is good and you think, oh, I love this person. So I believe it's good to have a relationship that is based on understanding communication. So when you take the unnecessary emotion out of it, which in this case I think is sex, I think you really get to know people for who they are and you can really determine if this is someone you actually want to be with rather than just getting caught in you know, feelings and emotions and all that stuff. So yes, I think um, sex is really not that important in the relationship. I think it actually messes up a relationship, at least at the beginning anyways. Uh, if you ask me, um, our question is a, a little bit <laughs> kind of tricky, but if you ask me to my, uh, on my own side, um, I mean, everybody is entitled to their opinion. I think it's actually important. You know, once in a while, you know, you, ha you guys color each other and then romance and then Love making, or sex, whatever it is you call it, I think is important in a relationship. You know, once in a while, you know, you guys just want to spend some quality time together. You know, make love like you're about to make babies. <laughs> I don't know. Somebody else might have another view, but that's what I feel. Sex is important in every relationship, basically because you know, guys. Let me just say, because the, a girl needs somebody, like a warm, warm accommodation, stuff like that. And the guy too, he also he needs someone to be with. There's something we call urge. So if you're dating a guy or a girl, basically you can't be sleeping with another person. And sex also builds up relationship stronger. It builds up relationship stronger. And and it makes it last. It makes it last. Well, I I think it it's kind of important and also not important. It depends on the kind of relationship that you have. Some relationship, you know, you know it before you get into it. You know that okay, sex is like, you know, as important as anything else. But some relationship, sex is not important. Some people are just you know like. Christian sisters are, but I know some people, some of them do it anyway, but then if you are dating someone who wouldn't ask you for sex, then there's no point having sex in the relationship, but some relationship, they, sex is important, and some relationship, it doesn't have to, you know, it's not as important as, it's not as important as that. Okay, sex, 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 sex is very important in a relationship, one, because these days, most ladies are freaky, freaky. Like, like say, sex is the number one thing you need in a relationship, believe me. Because no sex, the feelings is dying. I think sex keeps the relationship tight. It makes it grow. And uh, secondly, if there is no sex, I think you won't get to know the important things you need in a marriage because some relationship leads to marriage, why some don't. So it's very, very important. Very, very important. Yes, I would say yes and I would say no. Why for yes is if the relationship is well defined, I can say yes. That means you might have done your introduction, you know, uh, both parents know each other and you believe you're, you are heading somewhere. I mean, after the proper introduction, you know, some, there are some people who after introduction, they might not uh, 
at, at that moment, maybe they are not financially okay to do the wedding immediately. And which, if they've done the introduction, well, it's, they are still in relationship, but well, and I would say it's not important if the relationship is not well defined. It's not important. It is a mindset. It's a mindset if you program your mind to not to have sex, you know, before marriage. If it is ordinary relationship, but it it depends. It depends on the person in that shoes, in that position. But if it is well defined, fine. If it is not well defined, it's not important. <laughs> And you're not Badmos TV Entertainment without. My relationship is doing perfectly well in Nigeria. We are, we are like, we are, uh, I think uh, very soon we just wake up one morning and find that Nigeria has been sold. We are now slaves because with the way things are going, sorry to say, Nigeria is no longer a country, it's like a city. They just buy, buy us off one day and everybody move. Mm. We found out that wow. we're being sold. Okay, well, I can remember back then when you just went to school. Mm -hmm. You can say, I played to Nigeria, my country. That item doesn't work again. I think people just say it for fun now. There's nothing to play about it. Like it's also the pledge for fun. For fun, yeah. It's not working. A pledge is supposed to be what we stand on. When you're doing something, you're a leader, you're doing something for the country, you should think about that pledge. It's our stand. But when you're not thinking about it, you're doing whatever pleases you, not for. Because I believe when, when we call this a country, you're leading people, and those people have to follow your footstep. So are we supposed to follow the footstep of these leaders now? No. I think they're all corrupt. So for me, the pledge is not working. It's not even functioning. We're just saying it for fun. Even the students are saying it. They're just using it to play. We are the youth. The leaders, funny enough, the youth are the leaders of tomorrow. But in my country, Nigeria, youth are not the leaders. Old people are the leaders. Because we keep having these old, 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 old people in the state. The youth are not going anywhere. We're just there. So that saying said, the lead, you youths are the leaders of tomorrow. It's not working in this Nigeria, my country. It's not. We see ourselves as the leaders, but they're not giving us the opportunity. So it's not working. There's no need saying it. Here in Nigeria, you should say that word and say it. The old people are the leaders of tomorrow, but we keep having that old circle running. And it's the old people. But I think Nigeria needs fresh leaders, fresh blood, young blood, hot blood, good ideas, new ideas. Let's try something. We keep trying the old thing, going that red round circle, and like it's not working. We're going to end up going it like for years, and we find out that it's being sold to another country. Nigeria is gone. <laughs> My relationship. <laughs> My relationship for. It is doing way more than this country. I don't know about all that, but to me, my own current relationship is doing 100% more than this country, Nigeria. I, I could remember then when we are in school, would you say I pledge my country? Nigeria, my country. You pledge no longer 2020. Now it's I pledge to my relationship, my heart, Sorry, to be sir. faithful. Sorry, I pledge to my relationship in my heart to be faithful and honest, to serve him with all my strength, to defend him. <laughs> well, I would say Nigeria. Nigeria is, well. <laughs> Nigeria is not doing well, but I think Nigeria can do, you know, will get better than any relationship that I'll ever have. Wow. What makes you think Nigeria will get better than? <laughs> Well, I don't know. It's just uh, I have a different. Uh, maybe, maybe it's a face. Maybe I'll I'll get through this face. But I don't know. That's just the way I feel right now. Like Nigeria is doing well more than the relationship. Yes, Nigeria is doing well more than my relationship. So I guess you are part of the people that will <laughs> um, 
while in secondary school, I stick to, I pledge to Nigeria, my country. And <laughs> well, it, it, I'm not really impressed by Nigeria, but then it's just that I'm not really impressed with my relationship too. So. <laughs> And that's it on trending for today. Many thanks for staying here on Eniola Badmos TV. Remember to like and subscribe as we bring you more stories during the day.